hey guys today i am going to show you how to make and how to make an amazing login form and sign form for your website so here i have used this framework for an for an ad behavior of your form this framework name is materialize framework so you can see it here in first uh, let me let me show how our form will look after adding to our website so here uh, so here you can see this demo website which i have showed you before in another tutorial but today we will look at an authentication button so here you can see guys this two buttons are login and sign up button with an amazing hover effect here you can see when i was clicked on login button this form is popped out in same window and this form is for foreign two type of people one is lecturer and another one is foreign organization so here you can see this uh, this uh, transformation is also looking so great for this website now we can see this is absolutely amazing looking login and sign in form which you also can add into your page so let's see how it will happen so first uh, start with these two buttons here how i had this uh, into our web page move to coding part sorry before that we have to see how add materialized framework into the web page so this is a materialized which is i have showed you before now without wasting time let's get in start with the materialized so click on this button and then here is in this page you will see this download title in this title we have this materialized option so from here download make download materialize and make setting up into your web page here is setup here is setup that how you have to make materialize setup for your web page after that add this header files and at the end add this scripting file so here you can see this is the header this is the set of files and this is the html file which in this which this is the heading file and this is the scripting file which you have to add at the end of your body title okay so after adding these things you are ready to start with materialize so this is all things i have done for this web page so let's move on the further and see how it designed beautiful buttons for an login form in this header here uh, wait in this here here i have uh, these two login and sign up button with an class model tiger and wave effect for an wave effect web light for an web brightness and finally bt and for an materialize button property and other i have this id with a name login model so in that id i have added some css property already for add color and set position and etc here we can see that css property in title same id name here i have set background color transparent and uh, with an border solid 2 pixel width border color properly and text color of box is triple c means gray and font width 100 it means it's two lighter font this size that font is and set at 120 percent as of button of this login form but we have to add some extra property at hover time of button after next this here we have an hover id with an column hover in this id and background color will be triple e and box shadow will be none and border will be same same font color will be changed to cd 1 2 3 6 it means a on uh, 
some like red kind and another change in port it font weight it is 200 after here i added two amazing property which is transfer property for and login button which is transformation duration set on 0.8 pick it second it means it will take defined time for transformation default to over set now you can run your code into your browser and see your buttons is ready now see how i have add model form on button so here you can see when i click on so for that let me learn first from materialize okay so this is the uh, this is the model effect which i have added in this page so let's see how i have added this from materialize okay so here you will see how i have added model on my page this is a button in same as we want in here you have to go javascript into models so here you can see this is the button which we which we want so here i have set up of how i have added this into our page here at the bottom define some jquery next license so make sure to add this code into your javascript file so at the bottom you can see here this is the code which we have which you have to add on your javascript file for in your jquery initialization okay so this is the whole setup for in this model effect after this setup you have to add some input field in this model content division and design same as i have thought with login form so you will find your login and sign up form same as mine still if you guys find any problem with that then you can comment and uh, comment at me below and uh, until let's share to other this and like this video also don't forget to hit on that red button which has